I don't know about exciting. Of course, we've got the leopards here. However, before I even get into the leopards, there is a crocodile in twin dams. And this crocodile seems to be moving around to the areas that the leopard is moving to. So we've got to be careful. You can see the bubbles in the water there. Now, of course, Karula, who you've just seen, has moved away. I don't think they are suspecting it, but there's young Hosanna and Shungile playing very dangerously on this bank. So we better keep a close eye on them because I don't know if they've ever encountered a crocodile before. And I don't think that they're quite aware of the dangers of water. And this is something that they'll obviously have to learn. You can hear the birds. They're all alarming. The water thick knees. They're alarming at the leopards. But I'm also certain that they've probably seen the crocodile too. Now careful guys. There's Hosanna crossing the dam wall very elegantly. And I hope that he doesn't decide to go and play in the water because today would not be the day to play in the water. And this again was found by the magnificent Brent. He's just driving in all the right places today and he mentioned to me that it is a big crocodile too. It's not a small one. There we go. I wonder if they've seen it. The crocodile's just popped its head out. Can you see? Sorry, before it... Ah, it's just gone under. And he's watching them. Here he is, you can see. He's definitely watching these leopards. But they seem to be moving away now. Come on, guys, get away from this water's edge. Wow. There we go. That seems to be a safer spot. Except, well, thankfully, Hosan has decided to give Mama groom and show her a little bit of affection. But Shongile seems to be wandering closer and closer towards the edge. She's very intrigued by all of these water thickness. Here we go. Good girl. Come away from there. And she's looking more and more like her mom every day. Now there's quite a few vehicles that have joined us. You'll hear a bit of uh, a bit of vehicle noise in the background. But isn't this so exciting? My goodness. Hello guys. And Hosanna actually keeps looking back at the water, so I wonder if he hasn't spotted this crocodile. Maybe he's been a bit more vigilant than well, the sort of the credit that I'm giving him this morning. But how's that? Lovely. Hello, Mom. Oh, that's lovely that he's giving her and a good groom. It's always nice when you see them uh, giving it back to each other because... Oh, Karula's grooming him. Sorry, I'm half asleep here, obviously. There's the crocodile. Ah, there's the crocodile. Now, it doesn't look very big here. Sorry, I had that the other way around. Goodness, Hussan has got big. And it's not a small crocodile either. I wonder if it's not the same one from the, one, from the Chitwa Dam. I mean, it's quite possible that he could have very easily uh, walked that distance overnight. It's not impossible. And especially with there being so much water around. They don't need much water to hide in. So even those pans that the Hosanna and Shungide absolutely love to play around in, that would be a good enough uh, amount of water to stay hidden. 